Well, we're back here in our Studio 10 kitchen with <laughs> Chef Lucy Greer, back from maternity leave. She's with Greer's Markets, and the Greek shrimp smells pretty good already in the kitchen, <laughs> yes, Miss Lucy. Thank you. And it is good to have you back. We've missed you around here. Thank you. I appreciate it. I miss y'all, too. I feel like I've been gone forever. It felt that way. <laughs> felt that way. Please don't leave us again. I know. I'm glad to be back. Thank what have, you. What have we been doing so far with this? So, Chastity and I got the veggies in the oven. Okay. We're doing a sheet pan dinner, which okay. is kind of popular on the internet. It's, like I told Chastity, like a one-pot meal, but it's on a pan. So we started with a red bell pepper, a yellow, one red onion, and a zucchini, and one and a half pounds of little potatoes. We seasoned them up with some olive oil, some oregano, salt and pepper, okay. and we popped them in the oven. So that's at 400, and it's going to take 25 minutes um, to do that part. And then what we're going to do now is season up our shrimp. And once those veggies get a chance to cook, we're going to sprinkle the shrimp on top and let them finish cooking. Okay. So. so Got that battle plan ready to go. I yes. like it. <laughs> yes, you gotta do it in this way so okay. everything cooks properly. <laughs> so what is our next step? So our next step is to season up our shrimp. Okay. And if you aren't a shrimp person, if you don't like seafood, you could do the same exact recipe and you could use chicken tenders. Okay, so if people who may not like seafood mm -hmm. or may have an allergy, exactly. they can just use a substitute. Yes, so right. in the chicken tenders, um, of course, are going to be really quick cooking like the shrimp bar. So this is going to be a really great recipe for a weeknight meal. We've been talking about school going back in session really soon, and parents are already kind of thinking, okay, I'm about to get pretty busy. We need some recipes on hand that we can put together in a flash. And for people who, uh, I mean, this may, if they've been living under a rock, may not have heard of Greer's Markets, uh -huh. you guys got locations all over the place, right, Lucy? Yes, we do. We have 30 locations um, across. 30. I heard that right. Uh -huh. 30. Yeah, we have 30 across Alabama, Mississippi, and Florida. Wow. Um, two over there in Pensacola. Um, and we really, it, Joe um, always likes to say, whenever he's traveling around, he sees one, he stops in. So it's, <laughs> I feel like our stores are kind of like that, you know, you're kind of just driving by, you're like, oh, there's a Greer's. That's where he's been all week. He's hiding <laughs> a Greer's. Tell him is. to come back to work, please, <laughs> if know. you see him. He's been eating in the deli at one <laughs> of the Greer's. Um, so our stores, are. that's what we really like. You know, we um, get to reach so many people that way. Um, and we just celebrated our 100th year last year. And so we're just thankful to, to be around. And we're always trying to, to come up with new ideas and improve so that way um, people want to keep shopping with us. That's fantastic. So I just put one pound of shrimp in here. We did the juice of a lemon and you can a, smell it too it adds yes. a nice uh, aroma to the studio it's really kitchen. going to um, be super flavorful of course I got a seed in here because that always happens when you're dealing with lemons <laughs> and then I'm going to season it up with half a teaspoon of salt okay. half a teaspoon of our oregano and then we're going to spice it up a little bit with a quarter teaspoon of red pepper flakes and then I have a couple um, cloves of garlic here and then we're just going to do a little touch of olive oil. And all of these ingredients can be bought at any Greer's, right? Yes, and like what we were talking about before, my new favorite thing to do at Greer's is online shop. Now that I have three kids, I have not really been traditional grocery shopping in months because all I have to do is make my order online and That's then fantastic. I just drive to the store after work and they bring it out to my car and I still get to say hello to everybody because a lot of people love going in our stores because they love our people. Right. We have great people, but the great thing is you still get that interaction because one of our associates is bringing it out to your car, making sure everything's okay, and it's, it's just really great. It's just such and a time saver. Um, if you want to go, you can just go to greers.com okay. slash shop, okay. and when you get there, you have the option of choosing store pickup, okay. or it'll take you over to Instacart, where, Instacart, yeah, where you can get your groceries delivered. So, so you can either get it delivered, or you can just have them ready for you at Greers when you get there, and they'll just bring them out to your car. Exactly. Wow. Yep, so two options there. So, Both of which are super convenient for most people. <laughs> they really are. And um, like I said, it's just been a lifesaver for me and a lot of people I know that um, whether you have kids or not, you're busy. Um, one lady um, lives out of town and she orders her mother's groceries for her. Her mother just goes to the store and we load them in her car. 
So it's just So she never all, has to worry about checking her list no. or anything. It's already ready to go. Yeah, she doesn't have to worry about going inside the store. Um, oh, that's great. So it's for all ages. It's for really just any walk of life that just has a busy lifestyle or doesn't enjoy grocery shopping. That's I mean, true. Some people, you know, it's just kind of a chore. So we're just taking um, the fuss out it, of I it. I feel that way. Yeah, it's I like, do. oh, shoot, i got to go to the grocery store. But um, this way you just all week what I do, um, I just log in every time I think of something. Instead of writing it down on a piece of paper, I just log in, add it to my cart, and then whenever I'm ready and it to stay saved in there. Yeah, it stays saved in there. So you just register your account, it stays saved, and then when you're ready to place your order, you just click check out and there it goes. <laughs> That's, that is easy. I didn't even think about that. Once you think of something, put it in your cart on the website or the app, and then when you're ready to check out, I guess, you can just everything that you have or want it is in there, ready to go. Exactly. Yep, so easy, it's, it's been really, really um, great for me, and I know that there's so many others out there that would yeah. that really like that, too. I'm so trying that <laughs> yeah. this week. Well, please do. Thank you. Got you. It. And Lucy, we'll, what are we going to do in our last cooking segment? Okay, so in the meantime, I'm going to pull these out after they've been in there for 25 minutes, okay. our veggies. I'm going to put these shrimp on top, pop it back in the oven for 10 minutes, okay. and then we're going to pull it out and finish it up. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. And, of course, you can always go to fox10tv.com and click the Studio 10 tab for more, infor for more information on Greer's Markets. And we'll check in with Lucy in our next half hour. Chastity, we